I think women behave better in relationships when they know their husband or their man has options. Yo, Elliot. Yo, Elliot. How do y'all handle your woman when she's being insecure about other women? I'm 21, I'm a real estate agent, and I'm about to have my first Muay Thai fight in the next few months. I've been in a relationship with my lady for a year and seven months. I flirted with a coworker once, and I told my girlfriend about it because I had a guilty conscience. But ever since then, I've had a lot of stuff to work on and barely talk to women at all because I see no, I see no use in it. But an old friend from high school that was a woman reached out to me about looking to rent a property. Her and I had never had any sexual ties, but I used to have a crush on her. I have no feelings towards her, and I don't even follow any women on social media. Uh, but what advice would you give to me for dealing with my wife's or my girlfriend's insecurity about it? It gets really annoying. I do my best to remain quiet, still logical. Just seems like I'm fighting a losing battle. I know she's testing me. God bless. So... I think it's a good thing that she feels a little insecure. I think it's a good thing that she's a little jealous. I think a little jealousy is good for a relationship. And it's good for your girlfriend to be protective over you because it means that she has, she knows that you have options. And I think it's a good thing. I think women behave better in relationships when they know their husband or their man has options. I don't take it for granted the fact that I'm YouTube famous, I'm really good looking and charismatic and there are a lot of women that like me, right? They send me DMs or whatever, or comments, right? And I think it's good that my wife knows that that's the case because she won't take me for granted. There are a lot of good things, there are a lot of great things that are going on for me in my relationship, but the fact that my wife knows that I'm a high value man and that there are other women that want me keeps her a little first of all more interested because women want men that other women want and also it keeps her keeping herself together because she knows not that i there's no risk of her losing me i'm not interested in other women at all i don't do anything to go even near them but it all in the back of her mind she knows she got to stay a little fit she has to hold up her end of the deal, hold up her end of the bargain, right? My wife doesn't withhold sex from me. My wife doesn't not cook for me. She doesn't, she does everything to support me because she loves me, but also because she knows that I'm a high value man and other women would love to step in and fill her role, right? And that may not be totally logical, or it may not be totally conscious, but this is sort of a, this is an unconscious primal thing that's happening in her hindbrain. And so it's happening in your girlfriend's hindbrain, right? She feels a little insecure and that's okay. Let her feel insecure. You could also, you know, if you want to sure her up whenever she gives you that starts like shit testing you, I guess you could say in terms of the insecurity, one of the best ways to quell that for her is with comedy is with light jokes right like if she's coming at you and she's like oh so are you gonna are you gonna are you gonna screw this girl or are you gonna try to have sex with this girl and you'd be like oh which one uh one of the 20 that i just uh just left right like just say something silly like that like hey of course i am right like isn't that what a guy like me should do you know your girl better than me maybe those are corny jokes but the whole point is that you kind of agree and amplify have you ever heard that when a woman should test you you agree with her right all these women want to have sex with you right like if my wife says something like that all these women want you i say well can you blame them right can you blame them agree agree and amplify and what that does is it kind of like breaks the ice a little bit it breaks the tension a little bit women women are more feeling oriented and if you if she's feeling insecure and you try to you try to fight with her or you try to correct her, you're just going, you're fighting fire with fire. What you really want to do is put that fire out. And the way you put that fire out is with a little bit of light jokes. Just joke with her a little bit. Be a little, be a little arrogant in your jokingness, right? You don't want to be self-denigrating. Never self-denigrate. Never self-denigrate. Like self-denigrating guys would say something like this, like, that girl would want nothing to do with me, Right? I'm not I, I'm, that I'm not her type or um, like, you know what? I'm so lucky that I have you right. Like I'm your you're my better half. Right. Guys that say dumb stuff like that, like uh, like no, no other woman want me. Right. 
Women don't like that. They want to know that other women want you, right? And when you say self-denigrating jokes like that, it makes them think in the back of their head like, yeah, maybe I could do better. Maybe this guy isn't all that, right? I bet that girl just thinks he's gross, right? That's what she's going to be thinking in the back of her mind. You need, it's good for women to know, it's good for your woman to know that you are a desirable man. And she knows you're a desirable man. You've been with her for a year and a half. It seems like you're in a pretty re serious relationship. If she is your woman and you are her man and you're going to marry this woman, you're going to make babies, you're going to have a family, I think it's good that you have that little, a little bit of polarity, right? Treat her well. Do the right thing for her. It sounds like you are. It sounds like you're being a good husband to her. You're being a good boyfriend to her. But at the same time, the person in the relationship that kind of the person that has the steering wheel is the person with the options with the more options and it is always good for your woman to recognize that you have options not that you would leave her or that you would uh, engage in those options but that they're there and that way she remembers that she has a high value man one of the one of the ways that relationships are depolarized is because the woman begins to think that she could do better than her man because no one else wants her man as a man, no matter what, no matter how, I've been with my wife for 20 something years. We've been together forever. We have four kids. I still need to make sure that I'm sexy to other women, right? Not that I try or go out of my way, but I can't let myself go. You can't let yourself go. You got to still be a woman, a man that other women want. And that way your wife will want you even more. I figured there's a term for that. There's a term for that. But women want men that other women want. And it's good that your woman knows that other women want you. Pre-selection, that's what it's called. Thanks, Paul. Hope that helps, Jordy. Done. Yo, it's your bro, Elliot. I hope you enjoyed that video. If you did, you ought to know that it was a clip from one of my most recent King Transformation classes with my students, where among other things, we get together about four or five hours a week and we speak on things as it relates to becoming kings in our lives and fitness, business, and with women. That sounds like you and you want to join a like-minded group of men who are growing stronger every day in every way in this degenerate age, then it's real simple. Just follow me on Instagram and then DM me the word King, K-I-N-G, and then me and my team will get back to the details to see if you qualify. I really hope to see you at the next meeting. Done.